had a completed human genome. And what the scientists in this building were going to do was use that blueprint to find answers, find cures, find better ways to treat a host of diseases, cancer, diabetes, Alzheimer's, and so on. And that was really exciting. I mean, I'd been at the beginning when they were sequencing the genome, talking about the promise of the genome, and this was going to be an opportunity to see that promise come to fruition in ways that were, you know, previous thought impossible. Tgen is a precision medicine pioneer. So we work on the basic science side, but the science and the research that we do is really a coordinated effort from the clinical partners that we partner with. So we do translational research, and that means basically from bench top to bedside. Um, we do research not only because we're curious about, you know, infectious diseases and cancer, but we do this to help other people, you know, and to impact their lives positively. I mean, we could talk about the research, the cutting edge technology, but at the end of the day, all that is for saving lives. I think TGEN as an organization is set apart by being a nonprofit leader in the biomedical space, uh, really working to better the overall landscape of biomedical research and clinical care here in Arizona. The work culture at TGEN is quite relaxed, quite fun. Um, but very focused on the science and very focused on talking to each other, giving each other ideas, helping one another, um, and just really providing an, an welcoming environment that anyone can be a part of. You have people who are driven and passionate and you come here and you're excited to work and study and learn. And then you also, you know, get to close your laptop and go home and, you know, relax and have a life outside of work. You know, finding a motivation is, is, is key, I think, to any career, any job you want to do. For this job, it's easy. You get to walk into a building with a lot of smart people doing some really cool stuff. And the fact that you get to, in my case, from a marketing communication standpoint, work with those individuals to help them explain their science a little better, whether that's to high school kids, whether that's to a donor, whether that's to uh, an 86-year-old grandmother who wants to know why her grandson or granddaughter has a particular disease. If you can help them explain that at a number of different levels or you can help market that so what they're doing reaches a broader audience, who wouldn't get excited about that? I, it's just, it's, it's a lot of fun, uh, and at the end of the day, it can be very rewarding. I love working here. 